put herself out of the running and she really could have medaled today. Now this was uh, the athlete that the Russian coaches decided to put through into these finals. Something they could do despite the fact that she didn't qualify but it meant that uh, one of the other gymnasts was bumped, Gorionova. But uh, the decision has been more than justified and a good strong finish here on floor should guarantee her a medal. Yes, Gurianova's mum, I'm sure, is, is uh, very disappointed. But in terms of producing your best medal chances, the uh, tactics has played its part. They're allowed to do that. Their third-ranked gymnast was still in the top 24. Good twisting combination. That's a difficult spin. Double spin with the leg up, really difficult to maintain. Your balance on that pivot point. So that's been rewarded as highly as some of the tumbles. Nice finish. And uh, I think we've got a new name to watch in European gymnastics. I'm going to say that will be in contention. It's Semenova, though, that's the big name here. And she should hang on to top spot. Compass finish to that routine. 14.575, second position then for Afana Seva. It's going to be a good day for Russia. Yes, in the 80s, the Russians did that with Mostapanova and the gymna gymnastic fraternity were very upset. Confirmation of the final result then. Semenova won qualification, she's won the finals as well, ahead of Afana Seva, who didn't qualify but was put in there. And a great result for uh, Kaislin of Switzerland in third place.